Hey, Session, I uh, got a few things to say. Uh, first off, I like me to do with the whole removing sauce and conclave. That was a step in the right direction. Could have been a bit faster on that, but oh well. Second, are you ever gonna look at your wacky airborne circus featuring Spaceball not as an announcer? Do you even know what's going on in there? How can new people be able to eat the rare fruit when that rare fruit is connected to a wall of radioactive plasma? H how can we fight our true enemy if it takes hours for people to join? It, they don't want to play Team Annihilation all day, and those Lunawa balls are still bork during this time, and even then it takes longer for people to play Lunawa than anything else. And thirdly, why in the void did you bring this thing here? Do you even test these things? You you bought a two-handed weeb sword, and it doesn't even have a stance for it at all. It deals more damage here than anything else, what the fuck? Hello, and welcome to Video Games. Today I'm talking about Conclave because, uh, why not? Now, a lot of people in the Warframe community have a thing or two that just really grinds their gears. I mean, you have a Cephalon who hates Meg, a Grenier Defector who hates the Stug, a majority of people who hate their edgy hell spawns, and, uh... Limbo... Uh, oh no. Well, I'm... somewhat not that different, as I also have a thing that I can't stand using. Thing is, it's in Conclave, so many people will not have that the same feeling that I have with this thing. The Angstrom, everyone. Okay, press my some technically, but it's just as bad. In PvE, it's pretty decent. It's not a weapon that I would use as like a main or anything, but it's a pretty fun weapon to use from time to time. In PvP, however, it's pretty damn useless. Now, this aspect shot you might deal around 100 damage, but that's if all the rockets hit their target, individually or not. In which, good luck trying to hit someone with this thing directly. You'll most likely just achieve AoE damage if the explosion's close enough to him. For me though, I've gotten like two direct hits in the same match, and at that point I was ready to blow myself up with it. Except, oh wait, I can't even do that with using all of my ammo. And speaking of kills, the many times I was even close of killing someone, or even just stealing a kill, they've always like managed to survive by 10 or 5 health. I mean, it's a pocket rocket launcher, for, for Christ's sake. How can anyone survive something like that? But even then, I struggle to take down shields with it. And the only kill I ever got with the Angstrom was someone who was AFK, which even then, someone was already shooting at him when I spawned. I don't usually go after people who was AFK, but fuck, I just needed to kill one person with this thing. What? boggles me the most is that there's a skin for it. I don't even know why. The fucking thing can't even kill anything that isn't moving or with more than 10 health. Like, DE, this thing sucks. <sighs> I guess you can, like, take it somewhere else and not have to worry about using this thing in PvE, but come on. Just... Really? Jeez. Well, I don't know. If you were to use this yourself, make sure you use heavy warheads so you can have more of a chance to hit something with the explosion. And if you're even more of a masochist, then use the Hema if you have it. It's hard to get shields due to battle damage, and even with that damage type, it's not that much effective against damage in general. So, uh, thanks for watching this video. I'm gonna go burn this thing in the trash. 